Here I am in Rabbit Grove, and uh, I've seen a lot of rabbits. I am starting to starve. Uh, there was a nine hour blizzard um, pretty much as soon as I pulled up and uh, oh well that's horrible news I'm actually just wandering around down here looking for a uh, cattail head uh, of which there are none so I guess I can go back the way I came looks like also I will be eating my last can of beans Feels like just enough. Uh, is there anything I can cook? No, just this. Alright, so still feels like minus one. I think I have the two minutes I need. So I will lose my well-fed bonus in the very near future because this is my last bit of food. Oh, okay. Um, here, quickly, eat that. That'll warm her up a bit. Um, with the wind working on that uh, fire, that'll that'll wipe out the. Oh, it's one of these. What you talking about, Willis? Barren catch today. Winds picked up and turned offshore, so I had to come in early, as expected. Sleep for as long as possible. Curtains, door, locker. So I'm over here. Door. There we are. Let's go outside and grab our water. <clears throat> Like I was effectively, I've been pretty much trapped by the weather since I got here. Like I can't get very far in this without just plain dying. So it looks like we have to take some starvation damage. I'm all right with that, I suppose. So we'll hang out here for a little bit and listen to the soothing sounds of sharpening a improvised tool. How about we'll just see in the morning when it's time to actually go. Yeah, that sounds better. We'll see in a bit. All right. So I've survived 26 days. Um, that's hours gone by or 28 days on the calendar this is the 28th day so um, still a pretty decent uh, um, amount of gear I gotta say she's doing okay um, could use better shirts you know this other layer and maybe some ear wraps that would give me a full degree uh, just in the shirts if I could find two wool sweaters another degree there 
one there, one there. If I found combat pants, that'd be two. So three, four, five degrees. 18 degrees from uh, just, wow. Really, you can get up to, wow, well, okay. You can get up to 18 degrees with just uh, manufactured found clothing. So it looks like my, uh, my well-fed bonus is going to go. Um, it is really too early for me to be thinking about setting out. So I'm going to have to stand in the cabin here kind of like a, like a dummy. Let's see what else I have here. Are you fresh? Cured? Cured? Good? Good? <clears throat> hmm. Um, uh, not in the dark, but I can I can sharpen in the dark because I got my uh, stuff up here pretty nice. What to do? What to do? So uh, yeah, no fuel. I'm out of fuel. There are no sticks out there. Have another one at the ready, I guess. Do that a couple of times. Ah, the well-fed bonus. <clears throat> it treated me so well. I really enjoyed it. I don't need it. Uh, I don't have enough stuff. And even when I do pick up the, uh, the bear hide and stuff, such. Um, can I sleep for an hour yet? Oh, good. It's, it's easier on the calories anyway. Better way to spend my time. Because I can't now, I don't have the calories to read anything or do anything uh, that way. Um, we can do that. We can fix that up as we bottom out. Goodbye, well-fed bonus. Anything else? Anything at all? In the <clears throat> thing that I can... No, not really. Um, like, what's worth my while for sewing, really? You know, that's 0.2. Again, 0.3, so half a degree. Um, the socks will only give me back... I could probably, if I fixed everything, nice, nice, I could probably pull off another degree of warmth. Well, I guess it's not costing me anything, except for condition. Look at that condition. All right. So, we'll have a quick drink. And we'll pick up our hides. And our extra sampling there. And All right, here we go. Not the worst out. Um, you know what I could do. Just get the little heat bonus going from that. Gonna kind of scout around up here for sticks, but I don't think they kind of they kind of drop stick spawns in, in various places. But ooh, don't don't do that. I was gonna kind of jet down there and look for cattail heads. So yeah, now I'm a full day behind, and all my calories are gone because of a blizzard. I would actually like to follow in Dave's footsteps right at the moment and go running all the way to the mine. There's a stem there. Um, it connects to Pleasant Valley, which has plenty of uh, birch bark. But I must go this way. I've got to go back the way I came. I want to go 
um, just basically to try to complete the circuit. So I'm saving Desolation Point, um, the worst for last. Well, it's not the worst, but it's not really a, the kindest of locations. Yep, there we go. Almost made it out of there without the spray. Almost. And because I like to run too much, it really kind of puts it. All right, here we go. Inventory. This. Food and drink. Oh, I don't like seeing that at all. Use that on the... on the ankle. Just an excuse to drink some... some tea. That's all that is. All right. Okay, the pain has been healed. Just looking for Dave's stash of food there. I sure could use it. But yeah, uh, it's going really well. He bag he got another deer. Ah, oh, it's good stuff. Very entertaining. Successful hunt on uh, Dead Man's Challenge is always uh, just something else. You know, when you get a full stomach. Just, oh, so good. Well, we got a bit of a tailwind for once. Knock on wood. No, don't put that out. Believe it or not, it's actually helping you a lot. Whew. But that tailwind is a chilly one. It just keeps picking up. And you don't get a lot of wind cover out here on this old trestle bridge. So. There we go. One arrow down. But do you do a complete circle and do a headwind, do you? I have literally turned a hundred and eighty degrees, it looks like. I mean, sorry, for me it felt like at best a 45. Maybe a 90. Nah. Well, I won't quibble about the about the long dark and its love of of a, of a headwind. Hypothermia risk. Oh man. Now she's taking damage from cold. Well, we can put this away. It does us no good now. And I have to get to this cave right across the bridge. I've, I believe I've already looked at these and been disappointed. Yes, yes. Okay. So I have to get across this bridge here. Ooh, it looks like it's going to cloud over and everything. It's going to get nasty. It's, I'm not happy with having to backtrack, but I would like to go to uh, Milton and Broken Railroad and Hush River Valley then come back through, head up to the summit, and then come back through the mine, head back down into the uh, good old coastal highway there, um, and then... Uh, Head into the coastal highway and Ooh, a birch bark. That's good. But I'm dying. And then go to Desolation Point. Then that way I've hit every uh, zone as a dead man uh, propped up by T. Okay, I got to stop the. I mean, the hunger is a bit of a drag, but the uh, cold is really, really killing her. Uh, I 
I really don't know if it does less damage when she's sleeping. It doesn't sound like the wind really wanted to back off there. But she's at least warm for now. She needs water, or liquid at least, of some kind. Um, food. She is in... She's in a bit of trouble. <clears throat> so we're really hoping for a rabbit or two to be kicking around out here, but I don't think they like the weather either. Oh! He'll have to come back this way, right? He's, he's, he's going towards a brick wall. Or a stone wall. He can't really go anywhere, can he? Oh, good. He's coming back. He's coming right for me. This is the food I need. See that one? I beamed him. Perfect. All right. Ah, there it is. I was looking for um, that other piece of birch bark. So that while I cook my rabbit, I can make some birch bark. And then drink that. And make back some of the horrible uh, loss and condition I've managed to incur. But first I need to make some, some tinder out of sticks. Um, right here, in this area. Yes. Actions. Harvest. Perfect. I could use a mag lens if I went to the front. I, I haven't read all of these. Is she really going to outlive them? I don't think she's going to outlive the matches she's, she's got. Well, you know what? Let's give it a shot. <clears throat> Oh, there it is. There's the threshold there. Yes, I can. Good luck, girl. Please don't freeze to death while you're while you're doing this. I will just of course take a torch and move it to the back. I could do it all. Well, you know what? You'll get more life if I leave it here and just take a one small step backwards. So, you know what? We'll just leave it here. We'll just leave it right here. There we are. Go one tiny step backwards. Perfect. Um, inventory. Well, let, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not make it all about the. Need some water. Sure, any amount you want. Because that's not what we're cooking. Alright, and you get some water. Go on right there. Take that. We now boil that. Takes three minutes, good. There we go. That way, I've at least got enough hydration um, to do this uh, rabbit skin in here. Harvest the meat. Ooh. This guy's on a diet. He's on a diet. I think you lose a lot of condition from, from hunger. Uh, more than normal. Until boiled. We'll drink. So that in there. Now yeah, we'll do another water. Hmm. 
Okay, campfire is about done. That would have been embarrassing. All right, what do you got? 12 minutes, seven minutes. Whew. Pick up both of these. Eat our rabbit. I'm sure I'm sure she's absolutely thrilled. Drink a hot beverage. Again, probably really a nice a nice thing. How much how much water do I have? A little bit, a little bit. Okay, so kill this fire by taking a torch. And we'll get on out of here. Continue on our way. Is that a stick? Because every one of them counts. Because I believe I don't really have much of a choice. I'm going to have to uh, going to have to kill the deer in the ravine here and eat it. Now this is honestly, I like this. Um, the fact that I can get the the uh, tea to help help her along, but not too much. That was one aspect that I sort of miss about the game now, is the uh, recovery. Whoa! Yep. That was not a good move. That hurt. But there were times when you'd, you know, you'd struggle and struggle just to make it somewhere. And uh, finally get in there and get that little bit of a Well, th that's not going to help you. But you'd finally pull off, you know, what you felt to be kind of a, a major accomplishment and get, you know, get somewhere or do something, finally be safe, have a little bit of supplies to kind of heal up, and then the, oh, that, okay, so that's what happened there. And then you're, uh, and then you're on your way again because you know your supplies run out and such and uh, this with the no recovery and the and the, just the birch bark really gives it back that uh, the feeling of struggling to get condition should kill that rabbit that's behind me but instead I'll run away from it picking up this birch bark as I go because if I can if I can see the deer kind of get him into a good position because of course the wind's not going to chip in with anything useful um, that'd be great if it did it was like oh you shot something let me excuse myself and it's on it's way and you don't have to worry but it's more like uh are you throwing a party? Who didn't invite me? And he gets in there and blows your fire out. Wrecks your deck furniture. I'm not saying the wind isn't the greatest guest you could have, but he isn't. Pretty much kills a party every time. Okay. I left one standing. There he is. Okay. How can I interact with him in such a way that he comes right at me? Because I gotta make it easy for me, or else I'm not eating. Anything he could do to help with some, maybe some of those moonwalk moves or those stand still and stare at me moves, that helps. 
a not moving target is right up up my alley. That's it's always good. Okay, so he had to have seen or heard her stumbling around by this point, right? Yeah, so he ran back in there. Okay, well let's let's charge the deer. Ooh, look. I oh, missed it. Okay, that's not um, helpful. Because I, I don't know if I can get up there. I'm pretty sure even if I could get up there, I couldn't start a fire up there. So. Okay, okay, okay. Here he comes. Oh. Well, we got a floating arrow and a not injured deer. Calm down, fella. Darn it. There he goes up that way again. Okay. That's not helping at all. Yeah, she's going to start to freeze. She can go make herself some tea. It's really nice of the weather to chime in like that. And that is one tough deer. I mean, he took a shot to the neck like it was nothing. So we're going to go drink tea and sleep a bit and try again. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. This whole high wind thing I didn't see coming. That was kind of vicious. On other settings, I normally leave myself some food in this cave because I do tend to use it a lot in transit, but... Um, I doubt I will have left myself anything in this cave except for possibly some rabbit parts or a deer deer parts like you know stuff that cures all right now exhausted and freezing and about to starve yeah it looks like teas are only an option I mean I could go get into it with the wolf but I have a feeling that would wrap the run up come on now I know you're tired, but you're also dying of other things. Ugh. Yeah, she's not doing well. So I can't get the calories I need from the tea to actually take full advantage of all the tea. Ugh. One cattail. I should have left myself one cattail. How's this doing? Cured. With a couple of cured guts, too. I got enough. I got the makings of another... I don't know, something. A bow, maybe? <clears throat> okay, let's drop you, 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 you. There we are. Okay, so, all right. We're gonna, we got 10, 10 birch bark. That's 25% condition I could potentially get back here. Am I out of torches? I believe I've burnt them all, haven't I? Oh, no. Oh, no. Again with the no. No, oh, 25 sticks is nice. 
I'll have to cook up some. Oh boy, this is just. I'm just way too far behind the eight ball for my liking. <laughs> oh, you cruel game, you. I've got a feeling I'm going to lose my torch. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. So we're going to try it with the torch, the tinder plug, and the stick. Huh. 75%, eh? Not to be a stickler for detail, but that's 0% success rate actually right there. All right, here we go. Campfire. Adding the fuel. <clears throat> Let's get some... Let's get some sticks on here, I guess, for some some warmth and some, how much water do I, oh good, I do have enough water. So, drop that on, cook up some prepared birch bark, I guess I have to make more. Just dying away. Okay. Um, we'll drink that. Uh, we can set that down for now. Drink that. Look at all those calories. And now we can quickly sleep. For three hours. I know my fire is going to go out, but. Which hurts. It does. I don't think she's got much more time in this world. I mean, she's kind of. Bouncing back a little bit, but uh, that restore condition is not helping her. And now I can't see, and it is so cold out. I can't really hunt. I didn't bother to make up the rest of the tea uh, for the calories because it's pretty much just, you know, doing that whole, as they say, throwing good money after bad. I could have bled the deer when I shot him in the neck. That would have been good. I obviously did not miss neck day at the gym. So now it's like I've got... Oh, 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 oh you want to kill me. Thank you. 
because the green and ah uh, okay going in going in going in the green oh sorry for the mic bump there the green and glowing angry monster that shares the area with me there look at hacksaws i could start a hacksaw juggling troop if i if it suited me okay so we warm up not the worst thing that could happen but anyway the angry monster what's with the wind and the auroras i figure you know you're getting you're getting battered one way why they gotta punch you on both sides of the head Where are you? See, that was the wind whipping. That wasn't me getting barked at. Oh, a stick. Well, there goes the intense wind, or at least I'm in a protected area. We got some more saplings over here. I tend to not ever go down here because I don't like to deliberately have a wolf encounter. And he's usually in here. Huh. One cat tail. I should remember to take some of these tinder pieces with me too. It's ridiculous. Anything else around here? All right, we're starting to suffer. Okay, let's head back. Cool thing about the uh, Aurora Wolves is there's less of a chance you're going to run into one um, by surprise because they see you from so far out. Almost home free. Well, I got to say, the game kind of did me a solid there by not uh, killing me. Now, I don't have much to drink. Eh. For that matter, I don't have much to eat, but I got enough to get a couple hours of sleep without more dying going on. But yeah, I'm really dragging along on the bottom here. So, I need to get that fixed up. Yeah, see, that, that'll afford me about five hours of sleep before the dehydration kicks in. So, we'll go with, I'm going to go with four, because it doesn't, it's neither here nor there, right? I'm trying to think, did I get all the stuff out of the toilets in the dam? Yes, I did. <clears throat> Again, completely out. Look at those, just climb. All right. Ugh, what a disaster. I didn't plan this, by the way. This isn't, uh, I'm not trying to make this more exciting by dragging this person's death out. But I got to get out of here. And go start a fire. 
and it's best if I kill something and start a fire. Look at my cold meter. Pretty sure I snagged all these guys. But then again, I can't really see um, at all. So, okay, so freezing to death. Ooh, we got a nice fog coming in. So just so everyone out there knows, these are not conditions I would do anything in, usually. Where am I going to find something to kill? Oh, uh, you know what? There is that carcass up over here. If I'm still going the right direction. Right? There are the trees. Okay. Because, um, of course, I'm doing this in daylight too, right? So, I can't see. And uh, I also have some glare to make it more difficult. So, there's a deer carcass here. Sometimes a deer. Problem is, also sometimes a wolf. And since this is uh, the stalker wolf settings, probably a wolf. Ah, oh, she's so gonna die. Where are you? Okay, so again, I was expecting another wolf confrontation. Well, it is definitely time to start a fire. So let's, uh, what are, where is he here? There he is. Got a stick conveniently located. Okay, so. Start of the fire. Perfect. We'll do it that way because I burnt out all my torches. Yeah, I'm not being very economical or very good at doing this. There's a lot of cattails, not a lot actually, but there's a few cattails around Mystery Lake I can grab. Hey, there you go. See, 100%. It doesn't know its averages at all. Couple of reclaimed. Let's get some sticks going. I don't really trust the uh, fire to stay lit. Oh, goodness. We're gonna have to a little harder than that it looks like what is that a branch Ooh, a branch okay 21 there we go I have forgot my cooking pot and can Wow I don't think uh, I don't think I'm actually trying to get her to live. All right, here we go. We'll take a half kilogram now. That takes four minutes. All right. Pick that up. Boil that. Have a little bit of a sip of water again. Ugh. Boil water. What the heck? No, you can totally get the rest of that. Well, good thing it makes you turn. Um, it, it thought I wanted to shoot this can several times now. Okay, now we'll fully cook the water. How much time do we have before? Uh, 12 minutes. Nice. Okay go get this piece off next you 
It is not nice out. Look at all those calories. Oh, yep, there we go. So that's 32 minutes, three minutes until melted. What can I do with this? This takes, still takes 40, 40 minutes. And I have cured gut, so I don't want to really... Oh, we got some some crows re returning. Maybe some weather a weather change. Just eat that as we go. <clears throat> um, sure. Not to sound, you know, completely defeated or anything, but I don't think she's going to live for very much longer. All right, let's get this hide. Oh, yeah, 40 minutes by hand. I'm hoping that, you know, she just warms up. Oh, look at that. It's right on the edge. Oh, hey, the sun's coming up. Looks like she survived another day. a super hot fire um, for what I normally make you know 27 degrees outside and it's still not enough and it's still not very nice out not a good time for walking all right, I guess we'll have to make some water where we slowly become exhausted. Get nice and close. That is sad to see me uh, without any food or water. I'm not particularly fond of that. I bet you I can hit Beach Street over here and find some more rose hips. Oh, it's a rabbit convention. But they all ran. He's still running. Yes, and I've definitely been in here, looked around, made sure that was empty. Good times. Oh, and I'm out of rocks. Ugh, that was not a hit. I was hoping to hear a deer run off there. That would have been great. Oh, jeez, she's freezing to death. What a... What a champ I am. All right. Treat yourself, girl. Because I don't think... Mm, I, 
don't think the wind's going to back off. Okay, that bow has got to go. Yeah, so there's no deer wandering around back in here. So, this exhausted, do I tr retreat to the relative safety of that? Do I... Do I trust the weather not to burn out my fire? Ooh. Who wants to gamble? Don't melt it. I wonder if I sleep right now. 35. I might have enough. Oh, there he goes. Thought I would have just enough time. Okay, well that was far more successful than I ever dreamt it would be. Uh, I'm going to pick that up. Take a torch. Oh, that's a bad one. Here, you can have it, Mr. Deer. Um, take a torch from here. Also a bad one. Okay. There we go. That's better. So we'll just walk. Oh. I'm pretty sure I've already gone this way on this exact run. Um. <clears throat> Excuse me. But I'm, I'm pretty sure I went this way on this run to avoid the wolf that's usually over there. So instead, I'm going to go this way again, looking for cattails, hoping to avoid the bear. Am I hoping to avoid the bear, though? If I see the bear, I'm going to kill it. So, yeah, let's hope the bear's there so I can, you know, kill it. Don't fall down, please. Thank you. Yet. Well. Well, let's go see if he's there, you know? If he's not there, great. Uh, we can wrap her up in this cabin here. Get a few more hours sleep. Maybe even snag a cattail if I'm lucky. Oh, he's there, all right. We're going to kill us a bear. And I have no energy with which to do that. So, um, yeah, that's going to be kind of a... It's going to be a tough swing. He doesn't see me. Yet. Not the best time to run out of a sprint. Because he will see me. I believe. Okay. 
It's a little far out for my liking. Ah, uh, and then I just scared him. Well, I don't really have time for this, so. And I got a headwind. So I was going to start to kill her pretty quickly. <clears throat> so this guy comes my way. I'm just going to shoot him with a flare. We're going to call it a day. Either way. It would have been nice if that fire would have started for me there. That would have been good. Huh. Almost no indication that there was going to be any sort of wind pickup. Oh, that's good. He's still upset about that shot I took at him. Uh, about in there, eh? No, not not quite in there. Pretty much at where the, it drops off to nothing. Darn it. Okay. We'll head on in here and I'll uh, call it an episode, even though I'm about to start to die. Wow, that's some serious wind, I gotta say. Ugh, alright. Yeah, if that fire would have started, it would have helped me get my legs under me pretty nicely, I think, there. But, we've discovered a new location. Who knows, there might be a soda in here. Or not. Or a candy bar under a thing. Or nothing. There could be nothing, too. There's, you know, I got... Wait, what was that? Wooden matches. That was nice. So here's some matches. Now go cook yourself a bear. Somebody throw something out because it had raisins in it, maybe? You know, raisins are yucky. That kind of thing. I don't like this. No, it doesn't look like it. All right, well, we'll see you next time. Until then, keep surviving. I'm going to try to make it uh, so for her as well. Uh, how are we for stats? Uh, she's She could use a drink. Okay, okay, let's have a drink. Got enough calories to get her back or the condition that she needs. So, let's sleep right now. I'm going to go out and try to kill that bear. I got really nothing else going for me, so. And they're dumb. They won't go away, so. And there's some things to tear down, like this. Oh, yeah. Look at all that condition she got back. All right. Let's go see where he is anyway. He should be back on his circuit. <clears throat> Holy cow. You know, I'm pretty sure you weren't there. Like, I'm pretty sure you were not there. And there we go. So my next episode, I will be... Um, tearing up a bear. So, until then, we'll see... Uh, keep surviving, and we'll see you next time. He needs. She needs all the help she can get. And yeah, let's go get that bear. Right on. Thanks for watching.